Hi everyone, Andrew here. Uh, it's not often I make YouTube videos because I usually just post stuff on my Instagram. Uh, Andrew T. Bishop, if you want to see content more often. But for lengthy videos, I'll usually put one up here for YouTube. So this one is a comparison of sink bridges. Which are very vital I believe to sharpening especially when it comes to thinning because you want to if you get messy and you want it sturdy over the sink where you can easily rinse things off and whatnot so this one here it's the first one I bought it's the Naniwa sink bridge made out of aluminum but as you can see here and these rivets here and this here, I have to replace them because the rivets or whatever they, they they come with have a plastic cap, so it makes it easy to adjust and whatnot. But the the bolts or whatever themselves uh, aren't stainless, so they rust, which is kind of silly because obviously it's all over water. And even though I'll dry it and stuff and put it clean it up, put it away when I'm done. But this bridge has lasted me eight years and it's still pretty much going strong besides having to replace those things, right? And, you know, like you can adjust this so it'll fit, expand or shorten to the, the sink, but sometimes there's still a little bit of wiggle. So hence I put this little bit of rag there, keep it steadier, at least not be annoying with the sound. Okay. And then I like to use this stone holder, right? So you can fit the stone holder in place, which is nice, holds the stone, keeps that even up a bit more. And then as long as you know like they're same brand and size and whatnot, it's easy enough to just switch out the stone. And it keeps it right there, right? And then I, what I like, these are Naniwa Chosra. Then you want to adjust it to their Naniwa, right? Naniwa stone holder. Is that it pretty much matches the same size as the Naniwa Chosra with the base on it. Right? So that's nice. Not everything's uniform though. So you can see here is where this part here would adjust to hold the stone in place besides this lip here right and then like I said this had a plastic knob on it but that bolt had to get replaced and unless I could find something different what I've had to do is use a screwdriver right which is all right but then you know like look it gets kind of you got to do this to tighten it back up. Right, you got to hold the stone in place, make sure that's in place, and and then tighten it, right? Like so, it's kind of kind of like got to like twist and do things with different. But you know what? Like it it holds it, right? So, but. This kind of like, ha yeah, these parts got really loose and I ended up having to get, just got my friend to rivet them. And then, then in the meantime, I ended up getting this wooden bridge that are quite common. Uh, but there's a lot of things I didn't really seem to like about it. And then it only took a month and a half until it broke down, really. Because it had a cheap wooden part. Basically, this part here was like a wooden slat and it moves, right? And you can adjust it with a little wing nut and stuff but it was made out of cheap wood too so even when you use it and dry it after and put it away it was just it wore out really quick it had cheap glue on it it's made in china you know like don't expect too much and then another thing is you can see when i run water over this right that even right up to here where my my other hand is right here right here that the water just falls through 
Great, and it doesn't drip, drip over this, the edge of the sink. The wooden ones don't have that little gap. So then I even have to put another rag here that would still get soaked up, but at least it wouldn't just keep pouring over the edge of my sink. So, so I mean, eight years still going strong. I have to replace a few things. Like this over the wooden bridge isn't doesn't cost that much more, so I would definitely go with this over the wooden one. The other thing though about this is like look at this. That's a this is a natural stone, right? So not all stones will be full length and be able to loosen this up. To be held in place by that. Right? Like it works on there, but that doesn't work. So that's another little drawback. You can do things like this and I don't know, find something like something else to put in there and hold it. And I've done that, right? But you know, when you have to flip it upside down and use a screwdriver and blah, 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 you might need someone else to help you with that because then that gets annoying. You don't want to drop any stones and damage them. What I recently got through the help and from working on Juan Burrito meeting him through Facebook and whatnot, working on some of his knives. He sent me for thinning, and I use this a lot on his and many other knives. But he came up with this idea. He's like, how about I get you a cast fly? Because these are like the Cadillac of sink bridges. These are the top of the line, but they cost money, right? Like, when things are getting tough for the cost of living right now these days, you know, inflation and everything going up in price, well, this is an investment, so I wanted to get one, but he made it possible a lot quicker. And I have to thank you. I can't thank him enough. Like, this thing is so wicked. Look at this. Look. I just popped it in my sink, and you can just, like, look. Sorry. Doing this one hand. This thing's heavy. But anyways. And no rattle, right? And this is adjustable to fit on different sink sizes, right? And then, not only that, but it came with these little little uh, rubber, non-slip, kind of grippy things you just tape over, right? So that gets rid of the uh, silly rag part, right? I don't have to use these no more. Still fun to use for them. And then, instead of Having to use this little thing and use a screwdriver. You can just do it with these wing nuts here. Right here. Like you don't have to move it and take it apart or like flip it over and use a tool. It's all adjustable. So I can even put okay, I'll have to give this some more room here this way. I can put my stone holder in here. Right, and swap out zones as I like. Doesn't really need it. It does have a bit more clearance and stuff. And just to double check, well, pretty close. So I mean, easy enough though. Tighten that up. Okay, it doesn't move. So awesome. And even the little support here, the little middle support, is adjustable. You know? So now I can even use use it for my natural stones. Or any other stones that won't fit into the limitations of this. That is awesome. So easy to adjust. Oh yeah, so 
There we go. See, maybe this one's at a slant, so it's not perfectly flush with here. Let's try it with a different one. This one has a base. You know, so maybe, so at least it matches the size, but it might still have to meet somewhere in between with this give a little bit of room and do the old school thing with the wet rag you know once it's wet tighten it up you know it'll stay steadier but it's just like not completely flush with a straight like like a straight straight end there so i mean other than that like this thing and it's so durable so durable, like, we have to, like this here gets a little annoying sometimes because you can see it's only held together with one bolt. So this moves around, right? But can't wait to use this. Only doing a little comparison review right now. Cast fly sink bridge. My little nanny was sink bridge. This is great if you can only spend within like a hundred bucks, you know. Like get this one over any other cheap little wooden bridge. But you know, if you really want to make an investment and get something like skin a super last and has all the whistles and gadgets and you know super easy to adjust and things like that. You can't go on this. You would not be disappointed. You'd be like in all of it all the time, I'm sure. So thanks again, Juan. And hope you enjoyed the video. We'll definitely see more of the sink bridge in action. And any of my shorter videos are mostly just uploaded to Instagram. Andrew T. Bishop. Check it out. Thanks.